some of the best Godzilla videos I've ever reacted to. Let's get into this evolution. Film core. There you go. It's right there on the screen. Gojira 1954. Hold on. Wait a second. Oh, I thought it was the dude. Godzilla's come a long way because that Godzilla is looking a little embarrassing. Oh my god, it looks so old! But for 1954, that didn't look too bad. What is this? Looks like a fire hydrant. It looks like water coming out of its throat. King Kong versus Godzilla 1962! Gosh, there's been so many Godzilla movies! That one kind of looked like the current one. That looks like wind. That looks like electricity. Okay, they all got better, but... <laughs> okay, now that one. That one looks the best so far. Now, year over year, they seem to have gotten better in what looks like stronger which I would assume so. And by the way, guys, we're only one-fourth done with this video, and we've already went through, what, like six Godzillas? There's a lot of Godzillas! Godzilla versus Mecha Godzilla. That, that's, they're naming the movies. They're naming the movies, what they came from. Okay, now, the one before this one was way better. Oh, my God, what the... Godzilla looked like a weird animal insect thing, and he wasn't even that big. Look at this one to the... Oh my gosh! Okay, really? What is that, a cartoon? He looks like a cartoon! If he's a cartoon, that's okay. And then it got smaller? Oh, that one was really weak. Now we're going, we're going backwards in time. This don't even look good anymore. Now that one looks kind of crazy. 1989. Oh, look at the beam out of that thing. That one is by far the best atomic breath beam so far. Oh, we're getting big again. What? Okay, that was just like the other one, but he's just bigger. Oh! What is this, like thermal fire Godzilla? Oh! Oh, yeah, that one's definitely the best. What in the T-Rex Godzilla looking thing is this? This movie was just named Godzilla and it was in 1998 and he's just breathing fire. That's more like a dragon. That isn't even Godzilla. Okay, so at the movie at the top left, it says Godzilla, the animated series. Okay, it better be animated. It doesn't look bad. Oh, a little puff of smoke or whatever around his face. What in the world was that? Look, you can see the beam before it comes out of his mouth. Nah. All right, hold on. That thing is gigantic. If that, the other ones were the size of the big one, oh, this thing's huge. That one didn't look bad, that's 2004. Oh, now this, this is where we bring it back. We went from 2004 to 2014. Now things are getting real out here. Godzilla 2014, just look at him. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. That atomic breath right there sucked. There's no way that's what it looked like. Now I don't know if I can believe anything I've just seen in this whole movie. Or not movie, but video. I was about to say, what is that? But it's Shin Godzilla. It looks like a zombie. Oh, this thing's powerful. Oh my gosh, look at its mouth! That thing is scary! Oh my god! The other, the original Godzillas were like, you see my mouse here? That's how big it probably was. It was like this big. His, his tooth. The size of its tooth or something. Let's go back. I gotta, I gotta see the reveal of this thing again. Look, Shin Godzilla, scary thing. Whoa! 
What is that? It's Earth Godzilla or Godzilla Earth. That thing is huge. He doesn't even open his mouth for his thing. What? That thing is so big. <laughs> then we bring it back down to Godzilla, King of the Monsters. That one looks pretty good. Animations and everything look good. Oh, yeah! That's my favorite, 100%. But the that that Earth Godzilla, the body of that thing is so big. I, I would like to see that with the beam of the King of Monsters Godzilla right there. Oh, God. Okay, that was supposed to be way more destructive than it was. The buildings were supposed to collapse and everything. Whoa! Oh, that's sick! Look at that beam over there. Look at the beam on the left side of the screen. That, that's, that's a lot of Godzillas. That's a lot of Godzillas, and look at the beam of it. That thing is powerful. But, with that being said, hold on before we get through the, the rest of this video. Let, let me show you. We're going to go through when they show all the Godzillas again, so I can show you how big this Godzilla is, the big Earth one. All right, here we go. Let, let's get past this. We're going to fast forward past that. No, no, no. Back. Okay. Check this out. You see that big thing right there? Watch. Look how big it is. Those were big. Those Godzillas were big. And then look at those things at the end. What are those? They're so small. Oh my gosh. Look at how big Earth Godzilla is compared to them. That is ridiculous. Oh, nice day. First of all, they're running and this is like a really nice vibe. I really like it. Looks like it's gonna rain. Why is she putting sand on his back? What is she doing? Okay, I understand. I understand completely. Everyone here is an actor. Every single person. It's about to rain. So what they did was like, hey guys, let's go to the beach on a day where no one wants to go to the beach. So we can film the skit, right? But he's making this cool little sandcastle, which honestly looks really good. But you know what they use? They use a little plastic thing and just... Yeah. Ooh. Oh my! Realistic! It looks very realistic! Look how he came out of the water! Wow! It even blends in with the sky, like, what is he doing? Okay, the walk was a little funky, but are you kidding me right now? Let me put my shoes on. Oh, what is she doing? <laughs> Leave her! No! Leave her! Wait a second. Hold on, wait a second. She was putting sand on her boyfriend a second ago. And now all of a sudden, she's buried. <laughs> it was all about the transition, wasn't it? Oh, she's so dreamy. What the? Right when I thought Godzilla looked great, now he looks just like a weird human lizard. Look at that. Look, let's scroll back a little bit. Look at that. What is that now? <laughs> Everybody run and make an ugly face because you know nothing's actually there. Alright, I see the, I see this for much more than what it is. Now, I'm not gonna lie, this looks sick, but I'm looking at everybody recording on their phones and like, oh my god, but you know they're looking at absolutely nothing. Look at this guy right here. You can't even see where I'm pointing. This guy right here. That person is looking at us run 
and just holding his phone because you know somebody said everybody hold your phones like you're recording Why does this girl keep looking at Uh-huh! Run for your life, Sirenette's here! Oh my gosh! They did a great job! Where'd the military come from? Ah! So loud! This girl's just always there. She's dumb. Why would you hide in the sunlight? <laughs> Don't nobody feel they're safe in sunlight. <sighs> oh, yeah. Okay, so he tried to move the rock off top of him. Okay, and I want to show you guys. This is sound effects, all right? Look, it sounds like he moved the rocks off top of him, okay? Now watch. This little rock to the left that you're about to see is styrofoam, okay? You can hear it move a little bit. Listen. <laughs> it's styrofoam! It's a fake rock! Move that styrofoam off her! Oh, what is that? An electrical wire gone wrong! There's no way he would know they were there. But like I said, stupid hiding. Is that Siren Head floating? What is going on here? Oh, that run! Run! Oh, that run. He's speedy, too. Look at them hands helping his speed out. Oh. It looks like a child. Oh, they put a little bit of blood on the ground. <laughs> He's stuck in the building. It's decent. So far, it's decent. Y'all got to be kidding me with that one. Y'all have got to be kidding me with that one that one was horrible oh godzilla looks not good hey the cut on her leg looked pretty good though <laughs> multiple cuts on the legs and the dirt looks pretty oh please <laughs> Uh, I thought that was, piece of styrofoam was so heavy. Smack her. Look at the blood on her face, though, and her skin. It looks pretty good. Not bad. They're about to have a fight, guys, but the Godzilla part, this is going to be real interesting to see because you already know Godzilla's animations are looking real terrible. <laughs> Oh, we got to get the binoculars out. They're going to get the binoculars out to zoom in closely, but I don't know why, because it's not like they're right there in front of us. Oh, let me see a little bit closer. Wow, it actually looks decent like this. How did he move? Transformer? He's going to shoot an... AirPod at him. No way. Uh... <laughs> oh, yeah, he's going to listen to some music. Yes. Godzilla music. You know, he's making them blurry like that, guys. Because they don't look that good. And I know this. I 
Oh, here we go again. Here we go again. <laughs> this is a weird film. Vi video. What? Oh, baby, I'm getting excited. Oh! Coming up. Oh, oh, they're skipping every- Oh, they have little battles now! That's- that's how- I, that, if I was a Godzilla, which I'm not. King Ghidorah, oh man, there's so many that I don't even know. Hey, need help? Yes, you. Are you down in your luck? Need of an escape? Then what the, the answer to all your problems is the Rage Shadow Legend. Oh, it's an Rage ad! There I am on the beach. There's a big tidal wave coming in. <laughs> oh my god. Gojira. 1954. Oh, this is sick, man. You guys gotta go check them out. Film Corps making some crazy stuff. Okay, okay, it looks like they got downgraded a little bit. First version looked better. Wow, the first version looked even better than this one. There's no way the animations were that good back in the, those days. What the heck, it's literally getting downgraded. Mopper versus Godzilla. What year was that? Oh my god. I'm sorry, but they eat. They got worse, I think. What's he doing? Yo, chill. What is that jump? Oh my god. It looks like a frog now. Son of Godzilla, frog, 1967. Hey, this isn't Film Course prop. Manila? This. What is that? It's like a King Kong Godzilla thing. Is that Kongzilla? This ain't film cores. That ain't their fault. They're just making what it looked like. 1968. Now, I gotta say, it's, start, it's starting to come back. The first Godzilla was definitely the best, though. So far. I am Robot Godzilla. That's what that one looked like. But the, the Atomic Breath looked crazy. This is the Atomic Breath comparison, not the Godzilla comparison, right? Slightly upgraded, I would say, from the last one. 1975. Yo, he hit one of those nanays. He needs to chill. All right, come on, come on. Throw me, throw something crazy. He went from 19... What the... Is that T-Rex from Toy Story? Hanna Baramina... That sounds like a hot chili pepper Godzilla. <laughs> it's a cartoon. You know what? They just went like this realistic route and they did that? That was insane. Matsuki? I gotta say, what Film Corps just did there was highly impressive to me. Oh, yeah! I like the Kool Aid Man. Okay, you know what? That Atomic Breath sucked. Yeah, that was incredibly trash. Incredibly bad. Oh, this man took some steroids. 1989, that's my favorite! Oh, that one's insane. Definitely the best Godzilla so far. Wow. But this, I don't... <laughs> it's like a zombie. Whoa, even better. Oh! The atomic breath is getting way more realistic, way more destructive. I like. I like this. What? Will Godzilla? Okay, that the last one was still my favorite. I don't like that one. Godzilla Jr. No, he's like a dinosaur almost. No, that one ain't it. That ain't it. Still two two Godzillas. Uh, Godzilla heist. He's. Oh, never mind. That one's... Come on, show me something. 
Oh, yeah, buddy. That's it. I like this. Burning Godzilla's number one. Oh, you know, this dude is crazy looking. In terms of detail, this one looks definitely like a weird T-Rex. Wow, the colors. It doesn't even have like the spikes of color on the back. I don't like, I don't like that, but that one was detailed. That one looks like it's brother. It's cartoon version. Oh, it's, it breathes slime. Whoa, he had a building underground. Mecha Godzilla, right? Cartoon Mecha Godzilla? Cartoon. Sorry for the yawn. Cartoon. Oh, that was Cy Cyber Godzilla. I don't like those. They're just odd. They don't feel like Godzilla to me. Now we're back to the good old days. Godzilla 2000 Millennium. But how's it Godzilla 2000, but it was 1999? Oh my power. That man had a beam beam. That man had a beamer. And I ain't talking BMW. Ooh. Okay, GMK Giant Monster All Out Attack 2001, I think it said. These lizards are getting out of control. This rock music is nice. Godzilla against Mecha Godzilla. That's the movie name, 2002. Um, I don't know which one my favorite is anymore. I can't say that's my favorite. I can't say that. It looks just like a lot of the other ones. It has some cool like stuff on the side of its neck. And I gotta say, the solo on this guitar is going crazy. Oh, he's massive! Look at the buildings all destroyed! Final Wars Godzilla 2004. You'll see that atomic breath. Wait, is it like Frost Godzilla? What? What? That man just ran through some buildings. Oh, he's multi-talented. He got the blue and the fire flame. Gotta be my favorite. He's the biggest. He's got multiple things. And there was a little... Manila's back. Blowing literally smoke rings. Never mind. He's growing up. Oh, my Godzilla. Holy... I love it! He's crazy looking. Oh, that is nuts. That is number one for sure. The whole movie scene leveled up. That's crazy. The detail's massive. Like, it's just crazy. Shin Godzilla. Oh, man. I don't know. Let's see what he's doing. Oh, yeah. He's a little smaller than the last one. He's upset. Oh, my God, Zilla. I thought it was going to be some sickness where he looks so evil at us. The animations. Oh! It's got to be. Oh! Yo, they are building it up. Oh. This has got to be my favorite. Oh, he's destructive. It's my favorite. It's my favorite so far. Shin got... What the... He's tiny. Oh, no. It's anime trilogy. No. What an embarrassment. You can't even call that Godzilla. He's tiny. He don't even have it come out of it. 
Okay, now that that's his daddy or big brother. Oh my god! Godzilla Earth! You better not blow out of your mouth. Come on, I need a beam. What are you doing? That is embarrassing. What in the tail whip? It is massive. But it ain't cool. Now we go small again? But he's still massive. He's the size of a building. King of the monsters. Oh, the eyes light up. Yes! Oh, the... Look at his throat! It was going... Uh, uh, uh. Oh, man. Oh! Oh, the music! Number one, no doubt. 2019. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, what is this? It's like downgraded, but it's the Shinka Lion movie. You gotta impress me. He looks a little older style. Snow, Frost Godzilla kind of gig. Last one's still my favorite, 2019. That one was 2019 also though. Oh my God. Holy Godzilla singular point. It says 2021 and then on his. He is insane looking. What is that? Is he going to end my life? This man has beams around his beam. He's conversating with the gods of the Godzillas from different universes. He's insane! They literally have the music on point. There's another one? Of course there is. Of course there is. It's the almighty god of god, god, Godzillas. The top view! Holy! Oh, I thought it was going to be a top view sick like. That is cool. I don't know if this is topping the last one, though. Do it, do it, do it. Throw up in the sky. Do you ever think about that? That's really all Godzilla's doing is just throwing, throwing up. King door. He can't just come back. Oh, wow. One versus about six, bro. Uh, I don't think you're gonna beat Monster Zero. Oh my God! Now that is sick! Here we go, baby. And this is all the comments of his fans asking him to- Since being awoken by atomic you know, bombs, Godzilla has lit up the silver screen. Ooh, look at that face. But his looks seem to be ever changing. Oh, that's that's a joke on the left. What is that? That looks like a lizard. But maybe Godzilla is a lizard. Changing. Never mind. Starting with the original. That's Let's go through his theatrical looks and story. Animated. The evolution In his first ever appearance, of Godzilla! Godzilla has small arms, thick legs, and dorsal plates down his spine. His pupils are tiny, and he has fangs and pointy ears. That's embarrassing. After attacking Japan, he gets disintegrated to bone. A new gigantic, oh, whoops, I mean Godzilla, appears in Godzilla Raids again. This monster is thinner, with longer arms, a smaller head, and larger pupils. When in close-ups, his teeth appear to be jutting out. Sadly, he's buried in ice. But in King Kong vs. Godzilla, he busts free. He's now in color. He's more plump, toeless. Godzilla vs. King Kong is started a very long time ago. I didn't know that. He has a lizard-like head with yellow Ew. eyes, no ears, and no fangs. He faces off against a giant ape, tumbling into the ocean, only to be washed ashore problems. in Mothra vs. Godzilla. Now he's slimmer, has a whiter head, white eyes, and smooth, shiny brows. As his rampage continues, he gets covered in silk and again drops into the sea. 
But in Ghidorah, Ooh. the three-headed monster, he's back. Now with a slimmer face and longer tongue. God, Godzilla always looked very weird and not good, in my opinion. From this film on in the original series, Godzilla now defends humanity from more evil monsters. In Invasion of Astro Monster, Godzilla is thinner, his dorsal plates have more definition, his claws are dull, getting better. and his head oh. is rounder. He shows off his new dance moves before briefly being put under alien mind control. Dance moves! Ibera, Horror of the Deep, gives Godzilla less angry brows. Godzilla he does battles not against have a big lobster and narrowly escapes an exploding. Godzilla don't have dance moves. That is not what Godzilla does. Back in the day, Godzilla 1965, I don't know what they were doing, but they weren't doing something right. Island. In the sequel, Godzilla's neck is elongated, he's pudgier, and his dorsal fins are flimsy looking. His nose is also stubbier, and his eyes are bugged out. Oh, and Whoa. he's now raising a hideous son. <clears throat> in Destroy All Monsters, he's slimmer, while his face appears more like it did in Astro Monster. He's put under alien mind control again, but once free of their control, he turns on them. Oh. For the next three sequels, his look remains consistent. In the first, he uh. helps his son- It does not look scary at all. It looks horrible, actually, but this is like 1960. Face off against a bully. What the However, heck is this that? this all takes place inside the dreams of a young boy. So, moving on. Next, in Godzilla vs. Hedorah, he opposes a pollution monster, and when curled up like a shrimp, he can now fly backwards. In Godzilla vs. Gigan, Godzilla has gained the ability to speak, while his suit, uh, oops, I mean skin, starts ripping during his triumphant suit. battle. He appears slimmer in Godzilla vs. Megalon, with a shorter neck, soft, bright dorsal fins. Suit! He had a suit! What do you mean a suit? That don't even... And a round, pig-nosed face. He boasts a long-distance dropkick, but this movie uh. is mostly about a size-changing <laughs> robot. So, let's keep going. In the next two films, Godzilla has an angrier expression and more detailed oh, yeah. muscle. He uses a magnetic upgrade to protect an ancient god from Mecha Godzilla. And in the sequel, faces him once more. But this timeline, Godzilla is sent to retirement. Retirement. Nine years there has been so much Godzilla. Oh my gosh. Later, a real we Godzilla at? appears. This now this is the best looking Godzilla that I've seen. This is 1984. This one's taller, has larger dorsal fins. A Definitely a lot better. And his fangs and ears make a return. Although his reign is short-lived as he trips into a volcano. Only to explode out in the sequel. He has a smaller head. To make Thermo Godzilla, right? And a more muscular build. Larger outer fins and a... Did Godzilla just drink some protein powder? Cat-like face with a secondary row of teeth. He takes on a giant plant monster who gets turned into glitter. In Godzilla vs. King Ghidorah, his original form, the Godzilla Sora... What is that? Godzillasaurus, what the heck is that? That's embarrassing. Is taken out of the 1940s and exposed to modern day radiation, turning him into there a taller, we go. muscular, and angrier looking Godzilla. He fights Mecha King Ghidorah and then gets dumped into the ocean. And Godzilla Mecha versus King Mothra, Ghidorah? He's thinner, his dorsal plates are rearranged, and his neck is more ribbed. His head is flatter, and he has golden eyes. He battles against- This man just pulled out the 007 Nintendo 64 game Against Mothra and Batra, and once again is plunged into the- I don't know if y'all seen and that. he has golden- Look at- What did- You see that? Eyes. He battles against Mothra and Batra, and once again is plunged into the ocean and locked in by Mothra's magical powers. But somehow, in Godzilla vs. Mechagodzilla 2, he's back. He Look at that. He looks like a zombie. Look at his eyes. He has slimmed down shoulders and slimmer legs. He's also raising a gonna... blue-toned baby Godzilla. This time he's defeated when his butt brain is destroyed. But it's easily Ooh. revitalized just moments later. Godzilla vs. Space Godzilla feet. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. But it's easily revitalized just moments later. He's saying a he. He's saying Godzilla is a he. He said he has a son. He, he was re- This time he's defeated. He's defeated. He said he. Oh, see, here's the prop. Godzilla's not a he. Godzilla is a girl. Oh, yeah, I know that one. And if I'm for some reason wrong, which I know I ain't, that ain't gonna be too good on my end. Did when his butt brain Maybe, maybe down the line he changed into a girl or something. That that in the evolution, right? He is destroyed, but he's easily revitalized just moments later. Godzilla vs. Space Godzilla features the bulkier original with less detailing in the neck and, and larger just got eyes. Big. Godzilla Jr., who is taller and chubbier with a greener color scheme, and a large flying blue crystallized Space Godzilla, who gets Whoa. obliterated. 
In this timeline's final film, Godzilla is glowing orange and his son now looks more like a hunched version of his father. When the original Big G has a meltdown, his son absorbs the radiation and turns into the new Godzilla ready for action. But the series would be continually rebooted, dropping him altogether. The first American Godzilla what? appears as a large mutated iguana with blue dorsal spines and a hanging dewlap. This Godzilla also has hundreds of tiny raptor-looking offspring. But this happy family is easily taken out by basic explosive. Hold on, hold on, hold on. So the original Godzilla died. The son of that Godzilla also died. It got rebooted in America with what looks like a dinosaur. A look at the legs and the arms. What is that? Back in Japan, in Godzilla 2000, he appears shorter. Okay, Godzilla 2000, he keeps saying the he... So, that clearly doesn't mean that Godzilla is a she, so I'm thinking this Godzilla is also going to die. Because I know Tell It Animated is not going to get it wrong. With green jagged skin, sharp purple spines, and a wow. reptilian looking face. While oh. he's nearly swallowed whole, he's good to go for the next reboot. Godzilla vs. Megaguirus, in which he's Mega lighter, Gears? with a longer neck, and smaller mouth. He defeats a giant flying insect and is then sent into a black hole. In Giant Monsters All Out Attack, Godzilla is formed by the ghosts of vengeful World War II victims. He has smooth charcoal colored skin, white dorsal fins, and a hunched neck. His face is less lizard like, with pure white eyes and no ears. My god, okay, so the first Godzilla, they was evolutionized a lot of times, and the first Godzilla died, and then the son died, so. If you are Godzilla, you are that, okay? And if you die, there is no more Godzilla. But if he dies, does that make his son Godzilla? And you know how, like, you got a king and a queen. If they die, the daughter's the king and the queen. Or something. You know what I'm saying? Is that how this works? Like, if Godzilla dies, his son is now Godzilla. But this Godzilla is mutilated by a drill missile, leaving only his beating heart behind. Oh. The following reboot, Godzilla against Mecha Godzilla, re adds the Here jacket design elements and introduces a more wolf like face. In the climax, he's blasted by a beam, he, adding a He said he again, so it's scar still to his chest for the sequel, Tokyo SOS in which he's covered in silk and again flown into the bottom of the sea. Godzilla Final Wars features a taller, smoother, and more slender Godzilla with longer What is ears going on? Did he just drink Nutella? Red eyes. This Godzilla fights against a multitude of creatures, including an upright standing 98 Zilla. Then he and his hideous son head back to the hideous? ocean. Hideous? In Shin Godzilla, he's first shown as a light-colored and armless creature. What is that? Evolved, growing tiny arms and becoming more red with bloody accents. His massive main form is darker with a much longer tail that okay, has a little that, face Okay, that thing turned from ew to... Whoa. Man, his jaw can unhinge and split apart, and he has a variety of handy new skills. He can also apparently oh my reproduce gosh. human hybrids from his tail tip, but he's given a freezing agent, ceasing his evolution. The anime trilogy depicts a muscular rounded Godzilla with a tree bark like texture. What is going later, on? He sports beard like spikes and grows to his largest on screen size, easily allowing him to become the ruler of Earth. Meanwhile, back in 2014, a plump American Godzilla appears. This, this is the correct Godzilla. Titan has jagged dorsal plates, wide elephant-like feet, and noticeable gills. He comes out of high- Still saying a he. Why is he saying a he? Titan to stop. Godzilla ain't no he, man! Two hideous star-crossed lovers. In Godzilla, King of the Monsters, he's taller and beefier. His lower half looks less stubby, Whoa. his tail tip is more blunt, and his dorsal fins are less sharp and artfully glowing. Later, he's given extra radiation, and after ashes rain down on him, he gets a fiery new look and Whoa. power upgrade. Helping yeah, him to thermal retain Godzilla, his baby! Crown. But let's get into this. Shutter Authority presents... Oh, wow, look at the visual. The, the rain, the shine on Pac-Man and everything, the helicopter in the sky. Okay, first of all, I've seen the movie Pixel. I don't know if you guys have. And that's what I'm imagining. The big Pac-Man that's in the city. Where the, it, it, I don't know, it comes to life or something. It's been a long time since I've seen it. But Pixel, that's how the Pac-Man thing does. But this Pac-Man looks a little bit more crazy. So I don't know. Oh my god. Oh, the mouth in that thing is ferocious. Reports are in that a giant yellow ball robot with a chomping mouth is laying waste to several buildings. Yellow ball robot. Come on, guys. It's a living Pac-Man. Buildings in the surrounding area. 
with no sign of stopping. Look we at how fast it is. Oh, God. Oh, God. It's not eating them. It's just pushing them. No problem. It's huge. We need to go for Godzilla because he's like a titan of the world or Earth. He's an alpha. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Why does Pac-Man not have any eyes? New development. It seems that another large object has just arrived on the scene. Oh. It looks to be a colossal reptilian creature. He's going to throw like a basketball. Getting information that the creature that we are seeing arrive on the scene now is the mythical Godzilla. I can't believe what we're seeing right now. He seems to be eyeing the yellow sphere. It looks like Godzilla has gotten its attention. This is good news overall, but bad news what for the? Oh, this is different. They see it on TV and then go to a kid drawing it. That was he amazing. Right he seems to be eyeing the yellow sphere. It looks like Godzilla has gotten its attention. Oh, that's awesome. This is good news overall, but bad news for any unfortunate around. Oh, yeah, that's right outside your window. Oh, no. You wouldn't just act all casual. Yeah, it's Godzilla. Oh my god, okay, so first of all, Godzilla wasn't even this big a second ago, and Pac-Man wasn't either, and now they just keep getting bigger. A second ago, Godzilla was like, you know, he was a little shorter than the buildings. Now Godzilla's like seven times bigger than the buildings. No, that ain't realistic. Oh yeah, I'd be upset too! Oh my god, he's eating his leg off! <laughs> it looked like Godzilla just went bowling in a city. Oh my god! How is it not knocking over any buildings? I don't understand that right now. None of the buildings are being affected. It's a burnt Pac-Man. There's no way the robotics work in that thing anymore. Let's go back and watch that again. That was amazing. Godzilla had enough. He was like, ah! <laughs> Okay. Let's continue watching this. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Now you're a hunk of metal. Just rolling backwards. Wow, what people a beast. All over the surrounding area are cheering. That is the sound of people praising and applauding Godzilla as their new hero. I don't know what just happened, but Godzilla seems to be- How do you not know what just happened? You've just seen it on the TV screen. Like, look, it says breaking news, Pac-Man defeated by Godzilla. And not only that, she said, she said she don't know what happened. She don't know what happened. She just reported what happened. How's she gonna say I don't know what happened? It looks like he came here just to protect the city. Yeah! Shoot! Shoot! Do, 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 do! What the heck was that? What was that at the end? They were like shocked or something. <gasps> I'm so dumb. I'm so dumb. I know what that is. You know Pac-Man, right? Those little ghosts that the, the ghost can kill Pac-Man. Or, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's just stick with the simple part. The ghost that can kill him. <laughs> see, before we get any further, I'm already stopping. You see the helicopter's flying in, and you can see how it looks. And behind the, like, one-minute thing, you can see... Madonna D whatever it's Italy. So this is Italy, but look at the visuals. I really think this was like taken out of a movie, some of it. Unless this person's just really good. Which they are. Because the animation, this is not a movie. This was not stolen from a movie, but it looks like it. That was very unnecessary, I gotta say. That's King Kong's hand, obviously. 
And that was, I forget her name, but that was his girl that he really liked. Oh, he had to punch Godzilla in the mouth with the girl in the hand. See, that could have killed her. But you can see this is like an older version of King Kong. And then you can see on the left, Godzilla is kind of looking older too. But when you see what's about to go down, you're going to see why are these stupid helicopters out here? Oh, they're trying to shoot him. Like that's going to do something. Wow. Wow. Like, remember when I said low budget? I'm telling you guys, this is impressive. Like, let's go back a little bit and you can see just the work they did in the animations, the sounds and everything. <laughs> wow. Look at the tongue. Look at the tongue in Godzilla's mouth just swinging around. Ugh. Okay, now, I will say the worst looking part of all this is the girl in King Kong's hand. And, and Godzilla's trying to eat her, but see, they're making Godzilla look all bad, but Godzilla's not that bad. Godzilla is a decent monster titan. It's actually called a kaiju, I've recently found out. But I don't think King Kong's a kaiju. Why does Godzilla kind of look like a lizard? <laughs> what is, what is Godzilla? Is Godzilla a dinosaur? Uh, what is it? it? Is it a dragon? Dragons have wings, but Godzilla's like an overgrown lizard or something, right? He dropped her. Look at King Kong's face. Look at the animation. The detail that the person that made this did is incredible. Uh oh. <laughs> okay, I'm not going to pause it right there. She's running away. Wait, 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 wait. They were fighting over the girl the whole time. They just walked away. Okay, I see what they did. They weren't fighting for no reason. They were fighting over the girl, and now this is like a meme. <laughs> okay, really? Look at them. They're two. Look at the two idiots back there. Oh, where'd the girl go? I don't even want to fight anymore. Fighting over a girl. And why didn't Godzilla use... I don't know what it's called, but the... It's like where the spikes on Godzilla's back, like, does that noise. It's like, duh, 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 duh. And then it's like a big blast. Like a nuclear blast or something, right? And then where's this astronaut? The astronaut just farted. The astronaut just farted in the two, like, titans in the background. Or whatever they are. <laughs> okay, what is this? I don't know what this is. Beans, not for astronauts. Is this some kind of commercial? Is this a commercial? Okay, I'm going to read the description. Godzilla vs. Kong is a full CGI, best animated short film parody of a classic action movie's and their stereotypes. We love kaiju monsters and KVG, I don't know what that is, is a tribute to the monster verse with some humor. This is an independent short film made without a budget, like I said, brought to you by Hupe Animation. If you liked KVG, oh, Kong versus Godzilla. This is another monster short film. Oh, they got another one. We can watch another one if you guys like this because I thought this was amazing. But what else are they going to say here? A huge production. like They did an impeccable job. And it was a parody because of the girl. They were after the girl, King Kong's girl. But we're going to watch it over again without any interruptions. So here we go. You know, that part... Why? That's so unnecessary. This is like a... This could have been a commercial for the movie. This is impressive. This person should have been doing movies. Should be doing movies. They might be doing movies. I don't even know. Uh-oh! 
got to. Come on. <laughs> Why? Why is the astronaut there? I don't get it. They just randomly added him. Beans, or how do you say that? You're going to spell it in the comments below. I'm still not going to know how to say it. Best Italian beans since 1969. You know, this, this parody really did a lot of things. You know, they did this on purpose. This is not a real bean, is it? Bines beans? Godzilla versus Siren Head. Spooky night. Siren head first, probably. Nope, that's Godzilla, because he's in the water. Yep, I knew it. Not a he, but Godzilla is a she, supposedly. It's a normal day, right? No, it's not a normal day, because Godzilla's definitely after something. What was that noise? That was not a siren head noise. So Siren Head likes to attract things into the wild or to him with weird noises, and that's definitely a weird noise. Why would Godzilla... Oh, see, I'm just dumb. That's the Moth. Mothra, I think that's the name of it. That's another, like, Titan. So maybe hmm, Godzilla is attracted to Mothra because Godzilla wants to fight and destroy... It is a flashback. This makes a lot more sense. See, I'm just dumb. Ah. See, Godzilla's ready to go fight them. But really, it's not what she thinks it is. It is Siren Head. There's no way Siren Head lasts against. We need to be rooting for Godzilla because Godzilla is with us. Siren Head ain't. Who are you rooting for in the comments below? It's real slow in getting us into the action. Okay, there's Siren Head. You wouldn't even know. That's not a face I would want to see. It was right behind that tree, Godzilla! Do your little blast beam thing, because you will destroy- No, 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 that is- there's no way! No way! You just woke the beast! No, 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 no. There's- no! Siren Head is not as big. Listen, I've seen Siren Head is as big as like a telephone pole. Godzilla is way bigger than that. He is not the same size. And no, that little scratch would not hurt Godzilla. And the sounds that Siren Head can produce would not hurt Godzilla because Godzilla's loud. Ooh. 
Was that a tear? Uh oh. Ah, color changed. Thought it was gonna go blue. It's game time. Oh. <laughs> There's no chance. There's no way. Just uh. riding him like a... Ooh. Come on, use your, like, whatever that stuff is. There it is, there it is, there it is. Why is it white? It's supposed to be blue. Ooh, yeah! Burn! Oh! It shouldn't have took much. But see, I'm pretty sure Godzilla needs radiation around that for a drop of blood. To be able to do that. <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry, Head is not happy. No, that should not hurt your ear. Maybe, maybe, actually. He could be loud. Make Godzilla's ears bleed? Tears just popped. What? Destroy Godzilla, what are you doing? There's no way. Stop. No. Yes. This shouldn't even have been. There's no way that this is even a battle. Destroy Siren Head now! Is that a laugh? Don't get back in that lake. Or whatever it was. No, what are you doing? Hey, Slender Man, rip off! Uh, ooh! I don't know if you guys seen it, but it was behind my face cam. Come and get me. Oh, it's gonna take her. She's gonna take him into the water. And is Siren had a boy or a girl? Let me know in the comments below. Oh, you're dumb. Real dumb. Why would you escape? I mean, you know what? This animation is just different. Oh! They tripped and fell. Are you serious right now? So confused. <laughs> How could you not see that giant thing? That means sorry, it's scared. God. Oh God, this part was bad. I think it just wasn't good. That's embarrassing. What? No, 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 there's no chance. He's done for Siren Head, game over. <laughs> you see his little swim? Uh-oh. I said that part was bad. Now it's getting a little bit better. It's getting better for sure. That was like an old style animation kind of thing. Victorious! Godzilla wins again! Yeah, toss that thing. <laughs> uh huh. 
No problem. Here we go. We've watched some Shutter Authority before in the past. Oh, yeah, Pac-Man. Pac-Man, you remember that one? If you haven't seen it, go check it out. After an intense fight, Godzilla has saved the day once again. I honestly don't know what's in it for him to save the city, but it is apparent that Wait, we've already seen this part. True, I didn't- I've already seen this part of- Wait a second, maybe that was a part of a different video. On the news. Oh, I haven't seen this. What is that? What? Godzilla just go to his apartment? <laughs> what it, it Godzilla's making dinner right now? Wait, I'll be late. Who's gonna be late? Who's gonna be late right now? It's gluten free. I'll be late. Hold on. And Pac-Man is going back in for another attack. Well, why would Godzilla want to destroy his entire city? Because he's going out and fighting, destroying buildings and stuff. And then he goes down. He makes sure to probably not destroy this one. Don't destroy this building. Yeah, we've reacted to that video. Nobody watch, looks at the paper anymore on the toilet. Guys, we all have cell phones. This is, this is the weirdest thing. Oh my gosh. If I seen that in my bed, I'm freaking out. But that's his bed. <laughs> you can't do that, King Kong. Oh, this is gonna be... This is the fight we've been waiting for. Now that we know true identity. Okay, really? Look at that thing! That is an old version of Godzilla. I almost said King Kong. Oh my gosh! It's like red or something. Wait, is that Shin Godzilla? Oh, what it is? See, I don't even know who God Shin Godzilla is. Maybe I should look it up. Oh, that thing. Whoa! The thing looks scary. I mean, so does that, but the other one looked like something else. First of all, Godzilla is destroying everything. Wow, 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 wow. Just to let you guys know, the person that made this, all the like destroyed stuff, like they did a great job on how they did it. They're not just knocking into buildings and the building's not getting destroyed. This makes a lot more sense. Oh, this looks sick. Oh my gosh, look at it. Wow. Whoa! This thing is... What is it? Oh my. Uh-uh. Don't let me... Uh, nah, I don't want to be near that. Oh my gosh. These models were a little bit better looking. This animation would be so good. Uh oh. Oh my goodness! Oh, I'm 
liking this right now. Oh, smash in the face. This fight is great. This is a good fight. This is what I came here for. I didn't pay nothing to see this. Uh, I didn't get that out right. <laughs> What are they doing? Wrestling? Shoot your little laser beam out of your mouth. Oh, buy him in the leg. I don't know if you guys seen that. This is ridiculous. There's dust everywhere. Oh, man. I feel like Shin Godzilla is so painful. Well, they're both painful, but... Oh, maybe that one's more painful. I don't know, man. Oh my god, Godzilla can't do that! I should have said, oh my Godzilla. <laughs> and noise. What just happened? Did he blow up? Titanic battle in this city. This was actually pretty cool. Okay, there's no way you're just going to be watching this on TV. Like, you didn't see it. Oh, they got nuclear outfits on! Or no the way that was advertised was so incredible! I love the ending scene there. That was that was probably my favorite part of the entire thing. Let me know what your favorite thing was in the comments below. Did you think... I mean, obviously the first Godzilla uh, animation we've seen was good. The true identity version. But this one with the fight with the Shin Godzilla, that was sick! Don't forget to drop that like, baby. Subscribe down below and tell me what your favorite part of this whole thing was. And who won? Godzilla win? Or Shin Godzilla? I would assume Godzilla is the explorer. Never mind. They're both Godzilla, right? Ah, right, we'll see you guys in the next video.